Hi, this is Ms. Candleberry. I'm going to take you through. Um, oh, I'm going to take you through um, getting to our work for the week. Excuse me. So the first thing I want to do is I want to start with Class Dojo um, and show you where our event is. It's still in the same place, but I do want to take you through and show you what it looks like. Now, this is what it looks like for my teacher view. Um, but right here on the right, and I think for you guys, it might be on the left, it says upcoming events. If I click on this, it's going to take me to my telework dial document, the link to the telework documents. Uh, if I scroll down, you can also see this post that has the blue lions. That's going to take you there. If I'm looking on my parent view on my phone, um, oops, I got to show you that again. If I look on my parent view on my phone, uh, if I go to, uh, oh, let me, Go back. Here we go. So here I am. Uh, it's the first and stories. It's this first thing. It's got these little lines on it and it'll take you there. Okay. That's on my phone. So that's kind of what it looks like on my phone. Um, when I go there, it's going to take me to, uh, if I click on it, it's going to take me to uh, the link for our homework page at school. I mean, on our website, excuse me. And again, it says teleschool work at the top, but what it doesn't see right here, it says for the week of March 30th, this has been updated. I just didn't change that. So I'll go back and fix it later. Um, as you can see, if I click on here, I've got my teleschool document. I can have, you can download the checkmark version. Um, here it's advanced accelerated, um, or a, which also includes the, the cool daring and excellent reading work. Um, this is highlightable, but this is not the current Spanish file. I'm going to put that up. We just got it this morning um, after this video. And then here it says special choice board, which I will put up after this video whenever we get it because we haven't gotten it yet. Okay. Now, if you come to resources, which is right next door, this is going to have hopefully all of the video links for everything, including like this instructions after I'm done, the read aloud, the shared reading. And then all your lessons. So morning meeting um, on, are only going to be available on Class Dojo um, today. I mean, in most days. And you can see it's going to be, you can kind of see what's going on. Okay? So that's just an additional place to have that in case something happens. Um, you can get to it directly. All right? Uh, let's go really quickly through what you're going to be doing today. I'm going to, to close this and I'm going to show you over here. So here we go. Today, um, our on-level second grade readers are going to watch this video about six important questions. And then you are going to listen to this story. I believe that Miss Squillis is going to tell you a story. You can get to it by clicking on this right here. And then you're going to answer the questions about the story on a piece of paper. Make sure to number them one to five, your answers, and try to answer in a full sentence, okay? Um, for on-level math, you're going to watch Ms. Shouter's uh, math lesson right here. And then when you click on this, um, for right now, when you click on this, um, it's going to take you to some some cards. And you, it says on here you only do today A through F. So you do A, B, C, D, E, and F. The rest of them are for later this week. So please don't do the ones for later this week. Okay, that's second grade reading and second grade math. For my friends in Cool, Daring, and Excellent, you're going to watch Ms. Candleberry's um, Describing Characters lesson. And then you're going to choose a character from a chapter book that you are reading and describe that character using traits, feelings, and motivation. There is a very thorough example in the lesson. Um, you do need a, care, a book that you can actually look in. Um, and I do give you, I'm going to tell you in a second about how you can check out some chapter books, even though you're at a home. All right. So give me uh, at the end of this video, wait, wait, wait for that. All right. Right here, it says, our my advanced math kids are going to watch the area model and distributive property lesson. It's combining the two. So please watch. And then, um, on a piece of paper, you're going to solve one through six from the unit review found at this link. So if I click on this. It's going to take me there. Again, you are not going to go past number six. Um, you're going to take a picture of your work, and you're going to send me that. 
because on Wednesday, all you're doing is doing the rest of the interview. No, you're not going to do number 18 either day. Okay. Um, because on Friday, advanced math, just, you know, you're going to have a unit two quiz. I call it a quiz because it's not a full on test. Um, because you know, you're not at school. Uh, it's hard to give you a test and you're not at school, but please work this quiz by, by yourself. When you get to it now, um, I do want to show you how you can, I have a video here. Um, it's going to be posted. The link to this video is posted, um, below the link to this video. Uh, and this ex ex explains blah, how to check out chapter and picture eBooks using your full library card. And if you don't have a library card and your parents don't have a library card, guess what? Online, you can go register for your full library card online, which is pretty awesome. Okay. So again, you yourself can register for your Fulton Library card online, and that's this shows it. Or if you have one, it'll show you how to get to eBooks for kids, including like chapter books. Like you can check out The Terrible Two, you can check out Geronimo Stilton's. It's pretty cool. All right, and so definitely look at that because it's gonna have a way for you to check out books, which I know you want to know about. All right, guys. Have a happy Monday. Let me know if you have any questions in the comment section.